can I go into a little bit more detail about line leveling and what that is? Line leveling. Uh, I, okay, I'll take a stab at that question. I'm not sure if I'm going to answer it properly. So basically, um, when you're recording an instrument or you're recording, uh, like, like let's say like right now with my microphone, the signal... Uh, what, what, start, what starts the signal is what's coming out of my mouth or out of an instrument and hitting the diaphragm of the microphone. That is mic level, microphone level audio. Um, it's a very low electrical signal. So in order for that to be properly converted to ones and zeros digitally, or in the case of tape, laid down the tape with magnets or however tape works. It's been a while. <laughs> I think it's magnets. Um... You have to use a preamplifier, a microphone preamplifier, or in the case of an instrument, you have to have a DI box that translates to a microphone signal. Um, it, it has to do with impedance, and basically that signal is not equal to a microphone signal's impedance. A um, little bit complicated for me to even go into right now, but basically the microphone signal, even if it's a condenser microphone, is too low of a level for it to um, be at the proper signal to noise ratio. So a mic preamp boosts that signal level, the electrical signal level, so that the analog to digital converter can properly convert it. Otherwise, I mean, I, I can have the preamp all the way down, and yeah, there's going to be a signal there, but once you boost that signal up to a high enough level, there's a shit ton of noise, including digital noise. The digital, um, what is that? The digital quantization noise is what it's called. This is what mic level sounds like when you boost it with digital gain. So line level just keeps everything, uh, y you know, you can process line level signals. That's the whole idea of a, of a mic preamp. And it's called a mic preamp, like I said in a recent video, because it is the it's the amplifier before your speaker amplifier, because there's two amplifiers in your typical sound chain. This is what line level sounds like with a peak around negative 12 decibels full scale. This is what line level that was recorded at around negative 12 decibels full scale sounds like using digital gain to boost it to negative 0.7 decibels full scale peak. Um, again, bringing mic level up to line level and then line level to speaker level. So I hope that answers the question. And also there's two different line levels. There's the consumer line level and the professional line level, and I, I have a video about that. Um, basically, consumer line level is less.